Hello there! This is Amanda Wilkson of Amanda Wilkson Tarot. It is Sunday, January the 30th, 2022. I would just like to thank all of my new subscribers for tuning in. Thank you very much for watching my videos. I do appreciate each and every one of you. Welcome to my channel. If you're new here, welcome, welcome. Glad to have you. If you are a long-term subscriber, I thank you for your continued support. If you like my video, could you please give me a like, share, and subscribe? That would be fantastic. Thanks. How are you doing today, Scorpio? I hope you're doing well. I hope you're taking care of yourself and the people around you and vice versa. I hope you know you're beautiful, you're gorgeous, and you have that beautiful star shining bright inside of you. This is a general reading. Will not resonate with every Scorpio out there. Take what does and leave the rest. There's no gender in tarot. Cutting the deck for Scorpio. Spirit. Bottom of the deck, the strength. Having the strength to get through things that are challenging in your life. First card out. The Ten of Wands. Wands are fire energy. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Ten of Wands. This talks about the end of a burdensome cycle. You have been carrying a burden for way too long. It is time to drop that burden down and move on to a passionate new beginning. I forgot to get a drink. What is crossing this? The temperance. This is Sagittarius energy. She is pouring a cup. Pouring a liquid from one cup to another cup. She's got this gorgeous um, dress here. She's talking about divine timing. Being patient, trusting that Source Spirit Universe will give you what you need at its proper time. Consciously known. Page of Pentacles. Page of Pentacles. Pentacles are Earth Energy, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Pages are messengers. This is a money message. Look at her purse. Pentacles are money. Pentacles are coins. A money message. Unconscious. The king of cups, king of love. Cups are water energy. Counter Pisces Scorpio. He is... <coughs> sorry. He's drinking from a cup. He's got heart-shaped eyes and nose. He's got a heart-shaped zipper tie. King of cups, king of love. He's loving, he's caring, he's compassionate, he's a nurturer, he's a good parent, he's a good partner. Recent past, four of swords, looks like you were doing some healing. Swords are air energy, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Okay, it's like he is, uh, well, not like, he is closing this, ca this casket. This is taking some time to yourself to rest. Relax, recuperate, rejuvenate, heal, heal yourself. Near future, ooh, there's your passionate new beginning. Ten of Wands, end of a burdensome cycle. Ace of Wands, a new passionate beginning. In your near future, Wands are fire energy, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Aces are all about new. A new passion beginning. This could be a new passion project, a new way to make money, um, new lust, and somebody's wand, male or female. If you know what I mean. Where do you find yourself? Oh, someone broke your heart. Well, I guess that's why you were healing, right? And at end of a burdensome cycle, someone broke your heart. Swords are energy, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. This person's got his sword on the ground, and this other person is stabbing this guy in the back twice. Broken heart. External influences. Page of Cups. Cups are water energy, Count Pisces, Scorpio. Pages are messengers. She's got hearts for eyes and nose. She's got a cup here, and she's got a skull spoon, like Sally in Nightmare, of, Nightmare Before Christmas with the Deadly Nightshade Soup. This is a romantic message. A romantic message. Hopes and or fears. 
Six of Pentacles. You're looking for equal give and take in a relationship. Pentacles are Earth energy. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. I like the skull pendulum. Starting about equal give and take in a relationship. Overall outcome. Ten cups. Ultimate abundance and love. Cups are water energy. Cats, Pisces, Scorpio. I like the blue water. The color of blue and water in this uh, in this card. This is the whole. I'm trying to think of a good way. To say, the whole. This is the real deal. Real deal. This is the happy family. Ultimate abundance and love. A couple. Children if you want. Pets if you want. Um, this little cute house with a heart on it. Property. Ultimate abundance and love. Passionate beginning. New beginning. The strength. The strength. This is Leo energy. The strength talks about taming the beast inside also talks about having the strength to get through things that are challenging in your life but that's ugh, ultimate financial abundance you got the two great tens love and money love and money pentacles are earth energy taurus Virgo, capricorn pentacles are coins pentacles are money this is ultimate financial abundance this is the real deal that what I said? Um, the happy family. A couple. Children if you want. Pets if you want. Um, a nice house. Property. Ultimate financial abundance. Eight of cups. Cups are water energy. Count spicy Scorpio. She got a crown of skulls with purple flowers. They look like they're crying. Cups are water energy, can't spicy Scorpio. This talks away talks about walking away from something that no longer serves. Sometimes we get stuck in a burdensome cycle. And we need to have the strength in ourselves to walk away from things that no longer serve us. Because when we do, then love will come in. Walking away from something that no longer serves. Magician, the magician, the great manifester. I haven't seen him for a little while. There's a hand with an eye on it. It looks like a wand with a W. He's got candles in his sombrero, a pitcher, a sword, a wand, potions, I'm not sure, chalices, earth, crystal ball, wand, the great manifester. What are you manifesting? Clearly decide what you want so that it comes to you now. You can manifest cups for love, ultimate financial abundance, pentacles for, or I mean ultimate abundance in love, pentacles for money, ultimate financial abundance, wands for passion, swords for honest communication. And two of swords. Swords are air energy, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Like the... Eight of Cups, sometimes you need to cut something or someone, whoever gave you this broken heart, out of your life. My Libra card. Oh my goodness, my nose is running in. End of a burdensome cycle. Divine timing. A money message. King of love. Healing yourself. Yeah, from that broken heart. A passionate new beginning. A romantic message, equal give and take, ultimate abundance and love, the strength, ultimate financial abundance, walking away from something that no longer serves, the great manifester, cutting something, I think it's someone out of your life. You had a burn of some cycle, you got your heart broken here. But you've got a passionate new beginning in your future. And love and money. Love and money. Oracle cards. Four of 
Fork in the road. Moving forward, moving forward. Fork in the road, choosing a path. Chariot energy. Moving forward, always good. Yang. Divine masculine. And clean it up. Yeah. Clean this out of your life. New love, a new person is stirring your romantic feelings. Passion, new beginning, worth waiting for, divine timing, Sagittarius energy, and finances and career. Financial issues are a factor in your life right now. The person that broke your heart, were they after your money? Because once you walked away from them, you have ultimate abundance in love and money. The Hermit, healing, healing. Saw that, the end of a end of a burdensome cycle. Bottom of the deck, the lovers, Gemini energy, the lovers, soulmates, divine counterparts. End of a burdensome cycle, divine timing, money message, king of love. Resting, relaxing, healing. Yeah, we did have healing. Romantic message, equal give and take. Ultimate abundance in love, the strength. Ultimate financial abundance, walking away from something that no longer serves. A great manifester, cutting someone out of your life. Fork in the road, yang, clean it up, new love, worth waiting for, finances and career, the hermit, and the lovers. All right, Scorpio, heal yourself, love and money are coming in, passionate new beginning. Have a great evening, I will speak to you soon, this is Emmanuel of Emmanuel Centero. Bye for now.